Hi, my name is Terry Sproul and I'd like to welcome you to my studio. Today I'm going to teach you something that's super simple and everybody should know, and that is to make your own tag. Take a piece of plain cardstock. I usually use a white or a cream, and most of you know I'm not a big measurer, but you need something that's about a 3x4-ish. So we're going to cut a 3x4. Okay. And basically you're looking for a rectangle shape. Actually, I don't like that one, so I'm going to recut it. Like I said I'm kind of more of an eyer. I like that. That looks more like a tag to me. Put this to the side. Now here's the big trick. You're going to take your tag and you're going to take your two edges and you're going to fold them, but you're not going to crease your paper right here. It's not going to be creased. You're just going to tip touch your two tips together. Once you touch those two tips together, you're going to take your scissors and cut those two tips off. When you open it back up, you will have a tag shape. Now, since we did put a tiny crease in right here, that helps us to know where our center is to be able to punch a hole. I always use my punches upside down. You can use a punch or a hole punch, whatever you might have to make a hole. And if I put it in, I can actually see where that crease is. So I know that's the middle. And I can tell exactly where I want to do it, and then I can punch. And there is my tag. Now another really cool thing that you can do with a tag is you want to put ribbon in. There's a couple ways you can do this. There's two ways. One, you cut your ribbon to the length you need it, fold it in half, Put the folded end into the hole, put your two ends into the loop, and then pull gently. <laughs> and that is, I call it the luggage tag, I'm sure there's another name for it, but there's a tag. Now I'm going to take that one out because I also want to show you another way. You can take a brad right in the center of your ribbon, stick the brad in, literally through it, like that. Then you can take your brad, put that through the hole, open that brad up, like so. Now here, what you're going to do is tie a knot, which will cover that brad up, and you've got that perfect little knot covering the brad on the top of your tag. Hope you enjoyed that simple technique and always make your own tags. Again, thanks for joining me here in my studio.